Hi, I'm Lars Klint. I'm a Microsoft MVP and software developer, freelancer that even. I have a really cool tech tip for you today that is around efficiency. So if you're like me and you want to get this little bit more out of your day, here's a good way of doing it. Now, it's very commonly known that using a mouse is slow. It's convenient, but it's slow. So with Windows 10, there's a bunch of new shortcuts that you can use for, um, for doing all sorts of stuff. And I'm going to share a few of them with you that I like the most. So on my screen here, you can see that the first one I want to try and show you is the Alt tab. Now this is an old favorite, it's been around forever. Alt tab, if you hold down Alt and tap through your programs, will let you cycle through your applications that are open and switch between them really quickly. So no mouse, no mouse click on the taskbar or anything, just click and go. Similar now with Windows 10, we have Windows key and tab. And that lets you show all of the applications that are open. You can then click on one. So it's a little bit sort of more of an overview. Uh, similarly now, we have snap to grid or snap to the side. So with Word here, I go Windows key and left, and that snaps the Word document to the left. And similarly then, it, should, it asks me, well, what do I want on the right? And I choose the Excel spreadsheet. But we can go further than that. We can now also snap them to corners. So here, we can open other apps, and we can actually snap them to the side and then press Windows key and down and or up and they get snapped to the corners as well. Really, really cool and very useful if you need to have multiple uh, applications on the same screen. Another thing that most people usually don't do, especially my parents and it drives me mad, is just press the Windows key and the start menu pops up. But you also get a search bar and you just type in there. For example, here you type Word and you can see you can open Word. Just type Word and go enter. This means you don't have to hunt around trying to find out where your shortcut is or where you found it in the program files or any of, the, any of those things. And then similarly, you can also do, how do I make cake? And that will then become a web search because I don't have an app called that. Uh, but this will also search your files and everything else on your PC. It's very, very fast and very useful. And then the last thing I want to show you is if you press the Windows key and a number, so one, two, three, four, all the way up to nine, that correlates to the number of the icon on the taskbar. So in my case, I do Windows key and three, and Chrome is the third icon, and it opens up Chrome. It's a really quick way of opening up apps, again, without having to use your mouse, uh, and it becomes second nature after a while if you don't you know, move around your icons on the taskbar. So a little bit more uh, efficiency in your day will make a big difference.